guys welcome to vikrant tech and today we have the world's best bitcoin mining machine ant miner s21 hydro this is a 335 tera hash machine which works on sha256 algorithm and can mine bitcoin and bitcoin cash and all other relevant cryptocurrency which works on sha256 algorithm so guys on the right side we have our 12 kilowatt radiator so one by one i will show you everything how the piping connections will work and how will be the electricity fitting for this machine so guys as you can see this is the front profile this is the place where we will connect our ethernet cable this is the power supply this is the power supply socket and this is the output and from here the water will going to go in and from this side the hot water will come out and it will go into the radiator radiator will going to cool down the water and again via this tank via this pump the cool water will going to go in, into the machine so guys let's do the piping setup and let's do the cable setup on this ant miner s21 hydro so guys as you can see we have two ports on the radiator one is for hot and one is for cold so we will going to connect one pipe here and the other end of this pipe we will connect into the miner so guys as you can see i have connected the pipe here so guys as you can see i have connected the outlet pipe here which will going to go here into the machine the hot water so guys once the hot air goes here so guys once the hot water goes here it will come out from here and it will going to go into this tank and from the tank the cool water will going to go via this pipe into the machine so now what we have to do the piping is done on this machine we have to connect the power cord on the miner and turn it on and connect the lan cable so guys as you can see we will connect the radiator power cord here and this is our on off switch here is the power cable interface for the radiator So guys as you can see this is our power cord for ant miner s19 s21 hydro machine 335 terash we have connected the power cable here make sure it's properly connected you will get a click sound the other end of these cables are connected in our three phase mcb this is a hevels 63 ampere three phase mcb so 1 2 3 these are the three phase cable and this is for the neutral and the earthing of this machine is connected will be connected here via screw so guys the cable setup on this machine is now completed now we will boot the radiator and we will fill the distilled water in the machine so first we will turn on the radiator and we will drop some water by opening this cap into this as you can see i have disconnected the power cord from the miner all the piping is still connected so we have filled the water in this uh, tank by opening this screw from here we have filled the tank and as you can see once i turn on the radiator the water is getting pumped through the pipe from here and it is going in the miner and it is coming back here till now we have not turned on the miner because we need to make sure that all the air is out from all these pipes guys make sure your water temperature is about 20 degree celsius otherwise your machine will not boot some people think that they will connect the chiller in the hydro machines and they will going to provide the low celsius water but the miner will not be boot until and unless it gets a water temperature of 20 degrees please make sure that this is a very important information i am providing you here the water is coming out and there are no bubbles in the pipes everything is okay so now we will connect the power cord and we will turn on the miner and we will go to the computer screen and see the hash rate as you can see the water inlet and outlet temperature here guys using these two blue knobs we can adjust the fan speed of the radiator guys this is the front side of the radiator from where it will suck the air and from this side the hot air will going to come out so guys i have connected the power cable here now first of all we will turn on the radiator and let the water pump through the machine now we will turn on the machine via mcb guys as you can see we have turned on the miner the fault light and the normal light are blinking 
on the machine the ethernet cable has been connected now let's go to our computer screen and let's open the dashboard off for this miner now the fault and normal light has been turned off let's go to the computer screen and let's find the ip for this miner so guys we will use this software by the name of advanced ip scanner in order to find the ip of the machine your computer and your machine must be connected with the same wi-fi network then only you will be able to access the ip page guys as you can see that we have got the new ip 192.168.0.142 guys as you can see we are on the status page of the miner the default username and password for all ant miner s21 hydro machine is root root we will go to the settings and we will configure the miner miner on the desired pool guys as you can see i have configured the miner on binance pool this is my sub account name and this is the password so this has been configured now we will go to the dashboard and we will see that pool information is successfully updated and all three ports are working normal as you can see on the below side there are three hash board on s21 hydro right now each and every hash board is showing normal now we have to wait for five to seven minutes in order to see the hash rate on the dashboard page so once the data is here i will get back to you guys as you can see in the miner log each hash board consists of 216 asic chips on one hash board so there are total three hash boards on this machine each consist 216 asic chips as we can see the hash boards the chips are being detected as you can see the inlet temperature inlet water temperature is 31 degrees celsius right now and it has started increasing because the miner has been configured on the desired pool already and the frequencies are going up as you can see right now the miner is working on 410 we have to wait for the complete data it's showing abnormal above but once once all the data is updated i'll show you so as you can see the temperature of the output what outlet water is going up guys as you can see it's operating very very silent there is hardly any sound in this room the inlet and outlet temperatures are going up and the frequency on the hash board is 200 right now so we have to wait for another one to two minute to see all the hash rate so guys as you can see the green light is blinking on the miner s21 hydro there are the inlet and the outlet temperature on the radiator and let's go to the dashboard guys as you can see the miner is been working from past 1 minute 6 second and we have 335285 giga hash this machine is working above 335 tera hash all the real time hash rate is normal network status is normal miner temperature is normal so guys on the lower side three hash boards each hash board working in working on 410 frequency this is the theoretical hash rate which needs to be achieved and this is the real time hash rate as you can see this is the inlet temperature and this is the outlet temperature and each hash board consists 216 chips are showing normal Guys, you can head over to our website vikrantech.com and you can purchase all the latest crypto mining machines. Guys, as you can see, we are getting 345 tera hash on this machine. This has been working wonderfully.